my money. Go ahead, hit that clicker, bro. <laughs> hey, scene one, take one. Let's get a pappy. What am I supposed to say? <laughs> Action, motherfucker. Action, bitch. All right, try one more time. We got it all fucked up. All right, let's, let's try it again. Scene one, take one. Action, bitch. <laughs> yo, 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 you know what it is, man. The live is cloud radio show on the planet, man. Straight from the E-Block Radio live on your dial right this moment with your boy, the hood Howard Stern. Q Lewis holding it down from six mile to the mile high. I got my man Monk Money in the building. You know what it is. I'm yo, this thing. For sure. Yo, we got a we got a house full. I gotta fix my mic because I guess it's in the it's in the camera I'm shot. I got my man Gigabytes in the building. I'm here. You know what I'm saying? I got my man Kodak Lee. What up though? You know what I'm saying? I got my man we go yeah, we're gonna give Tay a shout out, man. We got we got our we got our production assistant in the building. What up, Tay? Tay Tay the assistant. You know what I'm saying? We got Pops in the building. He ain't on camera, but he off camera. He say what up though. You know what I'm saying? Got my man two G's in the building. What's happening? What's happening? For sure, for sure. We definitely back in effect, dog. You already know what it is though. It is social media Thursday. So if you got social media, make sure you Somebody choking the death out <laughs> Make sure you hit, up, hit us up on Instagram and Twitter. Hit up my man, Real Monk Money, and of yep. course myself at Hood Howard Stern. And the rest of these niggas, man, y'all can just catch them on our page. So I don't feel like giving all these shout outs. All right, so we back. Thanks. Yo, we ain't even got time because we like hella late. You know what I'm talking about? So we just going to shoot off. I ain't going to ask you what you did last week because I don't think nobody cared. All right, much. so let's say, what we going to talk about first, man, before we get in? We want to talk about them UCLA boys and shit trying to steal, trying to steal sunglasses. We want to talk about that for a quick minute. We can talk about the UCLA boys. All right, we're going to talk about that for a minute. What's up, 2G? It's time you had something to say. I'm just saying, don't do ball boys. Shouldn't you have some cash for them goddamn shoes? I guess they just being kids, bro. I guess they just being kids. I bet you it was a, I bet you it was a dare. Nigga, I bet you won't do it. Yeah. Right. Right. Uh -huh. right, I mean, they like what, 19 they, they or some shit? They glasses, right? Like, nigga, I mean, for, nigga, for, for several stores. stores. They ain't going to do nothing to you. Oh, they yeah. clowning. They just, they clowning. They just running around hitting yeah, shit. Yeah. yeah, I think it was from several stores, right, if I ain't mistaken. Yeah, yeah I think it was from several different stores. Now, the story, though, the story is is that they were supposed to get like 10 years of some shit right some crazy shit because it's China laws but uh supposedly supposedly Donald Trump sat down and kicked it with them niggas and, and negotiated a way for them to let them go and shit so that's why they was in the press conference talking about they they thank Donald Trump and shit hey, so now did he get a free a pair of three B's nigga <laughs> hell no <laughs> that's, but that's not hell before, no. the very least that's not before Trump tweeted some shit didn't he yeah, yeah, he had, he had tweeted some shit, but I think the press conference had already happened or something, or I don't know. I, I think they had already thanked him and shit. But, like, the, the crazy thing is, though, is as much shit as we talk about uh, Lonzo Ball, as much shit as he talk about his sons and shit, it's like, it's kind of ironic now that he kind of under the president's thumb. I'm just saying, it's kind of ironic. It's, no it's, a, it's a bad place to be. I ain't even gonna he lie. He ain't had no choice. His back was against the wall. He had to side with the enemy. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you had to do something with the enemy because he couldn't do it. <laughs> hey, them Where shoes ain't make that much money. He can fly over there and negotiate. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Right. shoes, uh, the high yeah. tops. Hey, fuck? shit, you never know, nigga, maybe. <laughs> I don't know, but. Yeah, go get his baby, bro. Yeah, I feel you. No, but it's, it's fucked up, though, because. It's going to put a bad light on them. Like, people already had, you know, yeah, they already had a, a, a certain thing to say about that nigga anyway. And now this kid doing some shit like that is crazy. But at the same time, we all been 18, 19 before, you know. That's what I'm saying. Like, we do some wild shit, and it don't make sense. Just don't. because he got a little bit of the press and shit, is they supposed to be rough. We did, everybody did some fuck shit back in the day, you know what I'm saying? Hell yeah, worse than that. You know, worse than that. Hell worse yeah. than some glasses. Especially when it goes to steal shit. So, so, so are you, are you, are you should be... You know what I'm saying? Getting chastised every fucking day for doing it? No, nah, but if I'm in China, though, I think if I'm in China, I'm a chill, though. Like, yeah, I, you. No, I think, 19, any, I think 19, any, 19, at 19, I think any nigga would have been. Remember when Kodak Lee would have bet you, you would have probably did it, bro. No, nah, if he would have bet me, then I'd remind him of that white boy who got caned over there and shit. You know, <laughs> I'd remind him that. That was like, back in the day. Like, 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 I'd be like, like, remember my man got caned? I'm not stealing <laughs> shit from here, dog. That's what would have happened. So, look what you're talking about. Now, he didn't talk me into some crazy shit, but not that. No, not that. Not that. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm not going out like Back that. Back in the day, he talked everybody into some crazy shit. <laughs> right. Still, it was never my style, man. So I it's still a one one nothing he was... talked the nigga into. Right. Was... <laughs> right. It's all kind yeah, of other shit. Feels dumb as hell, right? No. Fuck <laughs> Yo, we, we didn't even check in on Facebook Live, man. Make sure you hit me in the comment box. Make sure you can hear me. Make sure uh, I sound is good. I think my I think my sound man over there probably working that shit out. I don't even know. Hopefully. But, um, you know what I'm saying? Now he's on the job. Nah. He ain't working, boss. He ain't working. He don't even, he don't even know what they can hear. It's all shit. It's all bad. Oh, we good. We got, we got sound. This is up. All right. 
All right, so we ain't gonna talk about him no more, man. We go, we gonna move off of him. We gonna quit talking about Donald Trump and and Lonzo Ball and all this goddamn kids. We gonna talk about something else. Though. We gotta talk about Terry Crews. All right, so I didn't I didn't Google that shit real quick. I'm gonna do that while we talking. But obviously, I guess he uh, he came out again and kind of like told the for real story. Now at this point, I guess he got a, a lawsuit. Now did he? Uh, do anybody know if he mentioned the name of the person it was? I don't know if he put it out there. I don't think you put it out there. I'm going to Google it while we talking, though. But my thing is this, though. We talked about this shit off air, man. In real life, I don't give a fuck what my, I don't give a fuck what my career is talking about with my, my TV career or Hollywood career, dog. A nigga ain't about to grab my dick, and I ain't go, like, it's about to be a problem. Like, right now. I'm not going to wait 20 years later and be like, yeah, I, I felt emasculated. Like, nigga, yeah, no. Nah. emasculated, you would have, my forearm would have went right across his fucking face. <laughs> Right across bah! the face. I would have lost that job real Hell quick. yeah. Right. Whatever he, movie, he, I was going to be named, in that movie. Yeah, he named the guy, the dude's name is Adam Vinted. Adam who? Shit, I don't know. He's oh, Adam something. He's a Hollywood executive. Okay, so he, he named him. He, he named him. the nigga. Now, now, Gigabytes, man, I'm going to ask you before we go. We're going to go all the way around real quick on this. Dog, if that shit happened to you. I'll smack he, the shit out of his mother. Off rip, right? right? Then and there. Off rip. Now he I'll say he say that he ain't wanna he ain't wanna come off as the you know the angry black guy in, in the party full of people. At some point, that shit don't mean nothing to me, Hell dog. No. These be... motherfuckers in this party don't mean shit to me. Hell My no. career don't mean nothing. At some point, it's yeah. got to be a level that you not go across. You grab and my and this is one. You grab a dick, nigga. I, I'm not doing it. In front it. of your lady. In yeah. front of his wife, dog. Your wife. Like, so you go into the crib, she like, so you just let that grown man grab your dick? Now she look at you sideways. Yeah, you right. know what I'm saying? Are you a dick grabber? Right, especially after, his, especially after his role on uh, Friday after next. She might have thought some of that shit was real. Yeah. <laughs> Damn, Damn. White girls, Damn nigga. <laughs> Chicks white chicks, yeah. Yeah, sure. that white chick shit. Yeah. <laughs> I was questioning that nigga after that shit. He was shit. questioning that shit. Man. Co Kodak Lee, man. You at the party and shit. You know what I'm saying? You with your, you with your wife and shit. You, you got a career, a lucrative career. An executive come up and grab your dick, nigga. You, you gonna say something right there? You gonna turn the party out, my nigga? Well, when I get out of jail, <laughs> I'll release a right. statement right. through my attorney. <laughs> nah, for real. That's what I'm talking For real. Nah, I ain't bullshitting. Yeah, that because shit ain't gonna fly. That shit ain't just finna be no incident. Right. You know? And you just can't leave the way it leaves. It ain't just finna happen. I'm just, I'm not, you don't leave miffed like you had bad service at a restaurant. <laughs> no. You know what I'm right. saying? Right. And then 10 years later, oh yeah, they gave me bad service there. I got called a nigger there. Right. No, no, no. you no, gonna no, say no, something no, right now. Say something right there. This is way there. You got the green light to nut up. This is your goal. Hell yeah. This, yeah. Really this is your goal this as a black man. Let all that shit anger, out. All that anger. <laughs> let it out right now. Oh no, this nigga took it to a whole other level. Now. Hey, he no. said all the, all the aggression you ever had. Hell yeah. Let it out right it's there. A green light. Hell yeah. Man, you mother. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm finna overreact like a motherfucker. Right. Yeah, I'm about to catch this case real quick, man. I'm telling you. For real. I don't, fuck, I don't give a fuck if it's just fuck me, that, and, me and that yeah. one person. Uh, or me and the gang of folks. Dog, you grab my man part. That shit's not gonna fly yeah, this way. It's not gonna fly. Exactly. exactly. You grab a chick, you rub no, my man. leg. You touch me in that way, period. It's right. Yes, it's bro. It's a wrap. Because so, I'm going to tell you, man. it's a wrap. Yeah. My career's over, yeah. whatever the fuck. You getting a stiff jab. Cut. And, it's and, over. It, and it was and some weird shit all together. Because the way he explained it was like the nigga was across the room, like making little freaky gestures with his tongue to him. Like, this is how it happened. All this happened before. He saw the nigga across the room licking his tongue out of him sexually, suggestively. You know, I don't know if I said that shit right, <laughs> but whatever the fuck, you know what I'm saying. But uh, yeah, so that shit happened. He came across the room on some like plan shit, I guess, and 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 did. Matter of fact, he said it happened twice. He said he grabbed it once, and then he grabbed it again. Come on, bro. he said. He said this time. You he said this time. time he, 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 he said that. this time. He said he pushed him away. That's what fuck he said. That that nigga liked that shit. <laughs> <laughs> that is confused. He like that shit. That Fuck that. Uh, a second time, bro. That's what. That's Get what he said. That's what they said on TMZ. Saying, uh -huh. He was just embarrassed because it happened in front of his leg. That's what he said. He oh said he. My God, that's every what he said. Was right to fucking he go was just to embarrassed. No. no, I ain't even talking about his fairest like like what he trying to cover it up. Mm. I'm talking about he embarrassed because his fag fell out. Oh, 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 I don't think it is that. I don't think it is. You know what I'm saying? Somebody swung the closet oh, door over. Oh, oh, right. right. Oh, it's in the closet? <laughs> His skirt blew up and everybody saw oh, Thorne. Wow. Oh, that's so he was at that right party. So that's, 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 that's what you think, Kodak? That's what I know that's, for sure. I mean, you know man, sure? with common sense. <laughs> I mean, what the fuck? Twice? Yeah. Twice, right. I mean, that's the way they explain on TMZ shit. I don't know how Come true on, it man. is. 
Matter of fact, no, I'm, I take that back. It was TMZ, but it was him saying it. Like, he, See, this was I'm, him telling the story. Exactly. Come on, come on. Man. The yeah, first time, yeah, yeah, no. the first time wouldn't even happen. Y'all would have heard about that shit when it happened. Like, uh, Juan's been locked up for choking the shit out of nigga. Yeah. Because uh, <laughs> that shit went <gonna> fly, man. <laughs> Hell no. He did it yeah, twice. That shit gonna fly. And well, you doing I'm it saying. with my lady right here, that's going to give me What's every right. Trapped in the closet. <laughs> 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 Hell no. Nah. Hey, Hell, no. maybe this is, this is way of coming out shit. He's going to be like, fuck it. All right, look. I, I want him to grab a dick. Man, you did it for Maybe that's his way too, bro. He was gonna come out. Go, I'm going into stupid. it. Right, right. Like, uh, what, the, uh, I'm going stupid. What's my man named? The, uh, the other actor, uh, Spacey. Oh, yeah. yeah uh, so he, probably just, yeah, he probably won't jump right at you like, fuck it. All right. Yeah, I enjoyed it. Give him a cock grab. <laughs> <laughs> I enjoyed giving him a cock grab. Like, no, that was just his cover up so he could fuck with little boys, man. That was totally yeah. different. I don't, I don't even know what to yeah, say about man, that. that right. <laughs> All right, so on that note, man, we're going to get off for of Terry Crews, man. I don't know what's going on. I know ain't no way in the hell I'll let that slide for, for no amount of time. No amount. That shit was going to have to go down right there, even if it meant, you know, ruining whatever little career I had or whatever. I, I think you. at some point, man, you got to have you gotta have some barriers, my nigga. It's got to be somewhere you just won't go to. You should have took it out of opportunity. You're going to be known for something. Right. You and that's basically what Kodak said. Yeah, he said, take all, all everything you was ever mad about, ever. Yeah, yeah. Right now. And right now. You know for that. You know and for go off punching, on that nigga shit. Punching a gay dude in his face and grabbing your right. penis, bro. That would have been a fucking, that would have been like a forewarning for these motherfuckers. Oh, man. Grab dick, you're going to get punched your lights out. That's supposed to be, that's how I'm supposed to be. your lights out. <laughs> Yo, on that note, man, we're going to move away from Terry Crews and all that shit. But we're going to stay on this same subject. So if you're checking us out right now on Facebook Live, or on eblockradio.com, shit, or anywhere on earth, nigga, whatever you're looking at us at. All right, you got to know what we talk about today, man. We want to know, are women overly, overly sensitive, all right? Or is sexual harassment really getting worse? That's what we want to know. Hit me in the comment box, man. Let me know what y'all think right now. We want to know, especially ladies, man. Hit, hit me in the comment box and let me know what y'all think. Are y'all overly sensitive or is sexual harassment getting worse? Mm -hmm. Monk money, dog. Hmm? Sexual harassment. Is this shit getting worse? Or is these motherfuckers just out here trying to get a paycheck? Well, I'm not going to say it get worse, but uh -huh. it never changed. The same system changed. It ain't never changed. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The shit been the same back in the day. You know what I'm talking True. about? Motherfuckers just getting the balls to say something about the shit, just like the racism shit. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So they getting the balls to speak out on the women. You know what that's I'm talking what about? It is. And I think that's exactly what it is. But it's been going on all for the, for the longest. Yeah. And especially in the business where I work at, it's sexual harassment 24 7 in my mind. <laughs> like they want to tell them yeah, motherfuckers they yeah. could. Huh? The whole, the whole <laughs> staff would be right. done. You know what I'm saying? Because yeah, they say shit up. at my jobs. You know what I'm saying? Right. Where I work at, you know what I mean? Like, and. That shit just roll off the shoulder. It's a joke, you know what I'm saying? I'm yeah. laugh, you know what I'm saying? But but in some places it ain't some like places that. Some places it ain't yeah. like that. You right. can't leave my job expect to do that in motherfucking corporate world. You know what I'm saying? Right, like, but people do it though. But people do it though. Still do it. Yeah, people do, do that shit. And and that's the problem. You know what I'm saying? I think I think it's never fucking changed. So I don't think they overreact. I think they just saying something now. You know what yeah, what I'm that's my you personal know, thing. You know All saying? right, so look, I got I got to ask you this though. Ain't it perfect timing though? And this is always perfect time. What about what about our struggle? Yeah, right? yeah. Ain't this how we ain't this how we lost the black presidency? Yeah. And we didn't lose the black presidency, but we lost the 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 importance during the black presidency mm -hmm. because of women rights and shit. Now look, when I'm not saying did we have a black presidency. I keep asking man, you niggas this. Oh every god damn! Week. Here, we, here we go. Ne never mind. Man. We had a hybrid presidency. <laughs> here we hybrid. go. Coming from a dark skin nigga, <laughs> right? <laughs> but it's okay. No, but I'm saying like it, it is. I, like you said, it could be this point where it's just everybody just getting brave all of a sudden. And that's but I mean, is, is that believable though? But but it always happened when like 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 some you know big racial come out like the cops fucking up niggas, you know right. what I'm saying? Women rights, you yeah. know what I'm saying? Like motherfucking that happened during the civil rights. Civil rights, yeah. you know what I'm saying? They burned their bras and after that, then <laughs> <laughs> they, they forgot about niggas. Right? <laughs> hey, they burned their bras for equal rights after that. You know what I'm saying? Like how how many times you gotta have to you know put that out with equal rights? Just right. like like the uh, gay community. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They had their parades. You know what I mean? And do all that shit. You right. know what I'm saying? Okay, y'all do that. Yeah. But how, when y'all gonna be equal? <laughs> That's my thing. Like you want to be thing. equal. Right. When y'all gonna be equal? We gonna be equal for real. Yeah, y'all, y'all, y'all give celebrations and like I understand you're, you know, respecting your, you know, yeah. your thing. You know what I'm saying? That's yeah, what you thing. like. You know what I'm saying? Right. But when y'all gonna be equal? Y'all still pull up the shit like, like it's racism to y'all. Y'all don't know what racism is. 
Yeah. So, I mean, with that being said, though, still, I mean, you can't, like you said, you can't not act like it, you can't act like it don't exist. No, so, it don't. It harassment does. do it exist. Does. It does. But that's what I'm saying. Like, is it, is it, you say it ain't getting no worse, it's just more people telling. That's it. You don't think, I, 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 don't I, think, think, I think it could possibly be getting worse because motherfuckers wasn't telling. What's my man name, bro? <laughs> I'm trying to figure out his name, bro. He always he was grabbing the bitch's booty. He was a newscaster. Who? Uh, <laughs> a oh, newscaster? You talk, oh, you talking about, uh, uh, what's his the name? The one from CN, I mean, not, uh, C, oh, was that CSBN? Oh, God. Shit, I don't even know, name? dog. What happened to him, though? The name? white guy from the one, I mean, he was doing that shit ago. years and years ago. He said a couple months ago. Which no, one he about? just got exposed. Oh, he been doing that shit for years. years. Oh, yeah. What the fuck is his name, Who? man? Right, everybody named Weinstein and shit. Yeah, Weinstein did it. <laughs> Yo, my man Joe just checking in. What up, though, Joe? What up, though? Joe always checking us out, man. Joe the vet. You know what yeah. I'm talking about? What up, though, my guy? But, uh, yeah, so uh, Kodak, man, what, what you think, though? Is it is it sexual harassment, like, bumping up? Or it's like, I mean, or it's mean, like he I, said. I mean, it could be spikes in it, though. I mean, it, yeah. I mean, I agree with exact, exactly what he said. You know, it's just yeah. you know we got more media avenues and stuff like that, Bill and O'Reilly. more people. Oh, Bill O'Reilly. Bill O'Reilly. Bill O'Reilly. Bill O'Reilly. Yeah. That's the name. Bill O'Reilly. Oh, we forgot that. Yeah, right. 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 Exactly. <laughs> I don't know how we forgot that shit. Bill but uh, you know, but I don't know. On the, on the other hand, I believe it probably could be some uh. Spikes due to your man to talk about him again, 45. 45, right. You know what I'm saying? Grab yeah. him by the pussy. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He started that shit up, and you know, a couple times, you know, some shit did come out right behind that. Motherfuckers was feeling like that. I don't yeah. know. I mean, shit. temperature of America is kind of fucked up right now. You right, know no saying? matter which way you look at it. <laughs> right, that's for sure. So ain't nobody, so nobody's going to say, nobody's going to actually say, that is some overly sensitive women. Like nobody gonna say that. We're not gonna oh, test that, man, right? The dudes are purrs, man. I'm, I'm sure. I'm, just, just, I'm not sure it's some, but the dudes are purrs. He said he's sure it's some, but maybe maybe not as much as we think. No, man, man dudes are purrs, man. man. A lot of them, <laughs> a lot, like super duper purrs. But I still you know I man? still have a problem, dog. Like and and again, I, I hate. I hate saying shit that sound like I'm going against women's rights, but the reality of it is that I will never understand why the fuck you would ever take so long. Like, I would never understand that. You, do like, you understand a woman right now? Nah. So okay. That's, so that's, <laughs> that's the thing, right? No. I'm never going to understand, period. I don't know. You yeah. don't never no, understand. So. My thing is, I don't even try to understand no more. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? I mean, that's the way you feel, honey. That's the way that's you feel. That's just the way you feel. You know right. what I'm saying? I can't really try to explain it no different fucking way. You right. know what I'm talking about? Like, yeah. But, I mean, like I say, women are hard to read. Yeah. Anyway. Yeah. So. And some I, of these dudes are just trying And some of these dudes <laughs> yeah. are just trying it. Because if it ain't a layup, a lot of niggas ain't going to shoot. And, <laughs> and a lot of motherfuckers going to straight for that much. Straight for shoot that bitch up. <laughs> She like That's Bill Cartwright. Right, no matter what's going on. Bill Cartwright shot ass. Nigga, Whether she you know? said no or not. Whether she said no or not. You know what I'm saying? Right. Yo, that's crazy. If you check us out right now on Facebook Live, man, or if you're checking us out on the eBlock Radio mobile app, hit me in the comment box right now and comment. Are women overly sensitive or is sexual harassment really getting worse? Now, the crazy shit is, though, is that at this point, it's a uh, it's dudes now. I, I mean, I, I didn't want to talk about Terry Crews again, but I I got to I think in order to to get this little point across, it's dudes out here getting uh I, I definitely want to say molested, yeah. <laughs> but they getting bold now. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, honestly, bro, uh, <laughs> I might have got a sexual harassment at work because I had to choke a gay uh, dude up at work <laughs> at the dish tank. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I'm he said gay dude. Is that sexual harassment? Because he's he, gay. He, he, he choked him because he's he, gay. He, he, he rubbed me across my back and said, "Hey." And I just fucking Ooh, went yeah, for a stove yeah, I, I, and say, bro, don't ever fucking stoke. touch me again, bro. Like, flat out. Oh, man, you touch your ass. I, 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 so you want to go across Terry Crews. Like, what, what part of your back? The top. <laughs> hey, they the top. <laughs> the low top. <laughs> Fuck you. Okay, okay the lower. I'm just saying. Hey, like you like like your mid Your mid back. Well, anyway, he got choked up. Did you did you have something in your eye? Oh, uh, remember that movie? What was, what was the name movie? of that movie? What was that movie? Cover or Cover. 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 Yeah. Hey, Nick say you got some of your eyes. That was some good ass shit. That was some good ass shit. That was horrible. Yeah, that was horrible. That was horrible, bro. Oh, my God. Yeah, I did. But I'm just saying, though, I had to choke Buddy up. You know what I'm saying? And tell him, like, bro, like, I I respect you being a gay dude, bro, but don't fucking come my way, bro, with that shit, bro. You already know. You get the vibe that I'm fucking heterosexual. Right. I made sure you knew that, motherfucker. Right. You know what I'm saying? Ain't no discrepancy. And don't touch me. Don't, don't touch, touch me. me. Don't hit us. Right. Like don't cut. Don't touch me. Hey, that 
that that nigga felt real comfortable trying to come at you. Yeah, he did. Oh, he felt <laughs> not, no more, though. Though. Hey, not no more, though. Yeah, not no more. And so you more. think this though, like with a situation like that, that, I ain't with that shit. I ain't with that segregation shit, bro. You still a motherfucking person, you know? What I'm saying? He said segregation. You yeah. what? <laughs> I guess you can look yeah, at it like yeah. that. Yeah. The fuck I ain't really thought about that shit like that, it. though. I ain't with it. So, I, you know, I give them the same respect I give another dude. You yeah. know what I'm yeah. saying? I feel Just you. know not to come with me with that shit. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> right. He tried that shit. He tried that. me and he got choked out. But just like you said, just in that situation, let's just look at that situation right there. Now, don't don't you think, like, for me, I think it's a that's a... It's probably the wrong way to think about it, but I think that's the better way to to handle that shit. I would rather I would rather check the shit out of the motherfucker right then instead of like telling on the motherfucker. I, I don't know. That's just me. Like I feel like I need to check yeah, you, yeah. and I don't, I don't have to go to but corporate. But a lot of people shit. don't feel like you feel yeah. though. You know what I'm saying? Because me, me either. I didn't yeah. go to corporate. I just choked right. the shit you choked out of the shit out of it. And, and what about your business? <laughs> Kevin and Marshall Union Brothers. Uh, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? No, just know. like no, just like with Terry Crews. Like he had to tell nobody. He ch- he could have just handed that nigga. No, the you first ain't no time. big ass muscle bone goddamn steroid fucking freak nigga he supposed to uh, pound cake this mother that's what I'm saying but he wasn't supposed to tell nobody though no. He supposed to ball that nigga up in the corner, put him yeah. in the trash can, and go about yeah. his business. Right, right. And then tell his wife, like, you, do you know this motherfucker grab my dick? Right, <laughs> you know what right, I'm saying? Right. Like, where right. he is? Like, that's that right. nigga's shoe hanging out the garbage can now. You know what I'm saying? Everybody <laughs> knows how, how, how a woman can be, but like, shit, you ain't you ain't say that shit to that nigga when he grabbed your dick. Uh, oh, uh, you, oh, you know that'll come back. You know what I'm yeah. saying? You know that'll right. come yeah. back. Yeah. Niggas, you gonna hear that for you. Right. Yeah, you know that'll come yeah, back for real. You that nigga grabbed your dick? I don't care. Tell that nigga grabbed your dick to make you some tacos. <laughs> right in front of me too. She ain't gonna let that nigga lay that shit down. Never, dog. Nah, I'm with your bitch ass. With your bitch ass. <laughs> Yo, we gonna go to uh, to the comments real quick. Uh, Candy Cane just checked in. She says sexual harassment does happen to men more than we know because men are embarrassed to say that it happened. That's that's for sure. Yeah. And they and they never discuss it. <laughs> Hold on, my man Joe said, uh, you choked him. He said, but he could have went to corporate on you, and then you would have been in trouble. It, fuck the yeah. trouble. It would have been worth it. Right. You yeah. know what I'm saying? I ain't making millions of dollars. Y'all can yeah. fuck exactly. my fucking job. Yeah. <laughs> oh, so you're making oh, now, see, been so, so no. he, said, he said that's what Terry Crews right. said. So I guess that was that was his reason for not folding nigga up, too. Because no, he, he didn't want to get in trouble. Fuck that. Fuck, fuck the that. money. Fuck you grab my cock unwanted. Uh, you a yeah, dude. Fuck the money. Yeah. Ain't no I'm money. Just money. Even, I, even that is not crossing my mind right it, now. No, not know? at that point. I mean, like twenty years later, yeah, you can say in hindsight, I yeah, probably shouldn't have folded that nigga. Yeah, but and then but I did. you thought it was cool to come back and grab my dick for a second time. <laughs> <laughs> right, I mean, because apparently that shit happened two times. Right. So, yeah. yo, what's up, but man? But first of all, like you said, the nigga was licking his tongue out at him though from man. across the room, nigga. Man, like he so, had to be looking at him laughing that shit off, bro. Close to you, right? Uh, he supposed to let him know from across the room, like, hey, nigga, no. Yeah, no. You know what I'm saying? He's better than looking at you, like, no, no, the no. Fuck? Right. right <laughs> Something. Right. Shit. He's right. supposed to get the mean mug and shit. But that's why, like, like you said, he probably was let grinning that shit. Like, and that look, I look, I'm a man, bitch, I kill. That. That's my look right there, bitch, I kill. Right. Right. You approaching me now, bro? Yeah. Damn, Damn, that I'm fucking gay. You know what I'm saying? wanted some of Damon. That's what he wanted. <laughs> really? That's what he yeah, he yeah. He wanted to get some Damon. Damon. Yeah, yeah. Group hug, uh, nigga Charms, nigga. Group hug, nigga. Lucky Charms. Some Lucky Charms, well, I guess nigga. he wasn't acting because I would have nodded up. Fuck so he nodded that nigga out. Yeah. Yo, don't forget, man. If you're checking us out right now on I Facebook Live. I choked that nigga for rubbing my back. You grabbing my dad, <laughs> dog. <laughs> Oh. Hit us in the comment box, man. Let me know what you think. Are women overly sensitive or is sexual harassment getting worse that day would, by day? Yeah. That nigga would have got a fill-up box. Yeah. 20-piece, <laughs> 20-piece, four biscuits. Hey, my man, Joe said back in. He said, uh, the stigma of an angry black man is feared more by white people than a gay man harassing a straight man. They going to see that. They yeah. going to see me nut up. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. You said at that point, all that shit's out all the window. All that shit's out the window. I understand why I would have thought about that shit after, after I punched shit. him and got, got hit that full up. Yeah. Because he would have got a fucking fill up. <laughs> I would have punched that nigga in. He could at least made a scene. Don't don't touch me, motherfucker. Yeah, yeah, the scene. Right, make a scene. Make yourself. So so you would have been wrong even though you was right. (laughs) Anything. If you ain't want to touch him, you could have. No, man, but dog dog felt offended. What did he do, though? He felt offended. What did he do? Did he say. Don't do that anymore. Uh, what, what the fuck did he say, <laughs> man? What happened? He didn't say shit. He didn't say shit. He didn't say Stop. You know what I'm saying? Stop oh, it. Not, oh, not in front of my wife? What? <laughs> what? Nigga, what was said? Yeah. Oh, right, right, right. Meet me in the what? back? What did he say? What the fuck did he say? Not here? You got something in your eye? <laughs> <laughs> 
That's what, what I'm saying. What you got to write? Well, <laughs> you, got a movie, you must have got a movie role for me. Because, like, right. you're you right, though. Like, so what happened? Like, so yeah. you grab my dick and <laughs> he said he pushed better, him off. You better stop it. Right, and that was, like, that was... You <laughs> finished your drink and... <laughs> right, <day>. right. <laughs> I hadn't even thought that far. How was that ride home? I was like, right, right. Or oh, did you look at your wife like, I'm ready to go? ass ride home, nigga. No, you already know. You sitting there like you got raped and shit. He didn't got his coat in his head and shit. <laughs> he don't turn the heat up. It's winter. It's summertime. And, 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 and no matter what you that. think, that shit does go through a woman's mind. Just like uh, remember Crash and shit when uh, the police officer was was filling up his woman. That shot, nigga. Oh, that shot, bro. Hurt pussy. No, right. Out of that shot, bro. And she and she was she was so like it was a fucked up moment because he was scared. But then she was like, "No, nah, nigga, you ain't you ain't defend my honor." So nigga, that was gonna be the shit. right. You ain't do shit. shit. Yeah, that, that nigga right was scared there. though. Uh, yeah, yeah I, I think that's one of them things that hey, nigga, you, you got to you got to take the L on shit. Like you might have to go out down, nigga. Yeah. Shit, mm-hmm. sometimes it, it really got to be that serious. Yeah, it got to be that serious, right? Because because this this your woman, nigga. Like he just buy it. It's like a, you let him, man. Like you let him. Like it right. ain't like you wasn't there. You know what I'm right, right. saying? Like, at you that let point, him. At that point, it's just him and me now. Bitch, I was just gonna what, be you and me, dog. Yeah. I'm, I can't. Nigga, uh, what? The, right? most I can, the most I can do is like, baby, go live on Facebook so this nigga don't kill me. Yeah, right. <laughs> oh, okay, so that brings back to that. You remember how I asked? If you out with your woman. And motherfucking Mike Tyson walks up and slaps the shit out of her. What the fuck do you do? Mike I'm Tyson, getting punched next because Mike, I'm Mike gonna hit right, that nigga. Right. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you mean? Whether I do any damage at all, I'm getting slapped <laughs> next. Right, I am right. next. Be like, gonna be like my man on Friday. Like, you want some of this old man? No. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Hey, be get your ass up. Get your ass up. Yep. <laughs> yep. yep. We both about to get punched. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna hit you harder than that. Get <laughs> your ass up. That shit. You gotta go home and shit with your wife and shit. Like, we just have to nigga grab my. Hey, right. man, the, you know, bitch, no. what did you say to him? Right. <laughs> like, champ, what she do to come on, champ? Champ, 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 come on, champ. champ. <laughs> Yeah, no, it's gonna be now. just like how you was with uh, motherfucking right. Floyd Mayweather and shit. Hey, is this bitch worth a brain contusion? That's all I want to know. Yeah, yeah. I'm gonna eat it's that my bitch. Too. You just yeah. take my manhood. I'm, I'm gonna get punched next. I'm thinking the whole time. I'm gonna be, I'm be honest force. with you though. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. You take your life for it. Like just on the, we we get way off subject, but on on the nigga on the real nigga tip, dog. The reality of that shit is though is that you feel like if you with your bitch and a nigga feel like he uh, he got the audacity to grab her ass or smack her or whatever well, at right some there. point that nigga was disrespecting me. Like yeah, so at this right. point you it ain't even about this no more. It's like you saw me with her and you still was like yeah. fucking now we got a problem, it's, it's bro. It's 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 he basically called me a whole ass nigga, right? And I oh, and I'm cool with that. a room full of people like you a bitch. Come here, baby. Right. Like, exactly. It can't, it can't happen, dog. The male pride might be fucked up. It might get a lot of niggas killed and shit, but that right. might be one of the things I die for. Oh, yeah. You, know? yeah. you just not go, ultimately, you as a man, you, you ain't going to get disrespected like I can that. put you like this. I'm not about to square up with this nigga. I'll be right back. Baby, you okay? Man, I'm letting I'm that fuck I'm squaring up. I'm squaring up. Me and Tyson, I'm not squaring up. I'm hitting him because I'll be the second motherfucker like next. I ain't got, that's I'm pretty, that's pretty meditated right murder, nigga. I'm gonna pop we squaring up right now, nigga. I'm getting a first degree murder. And I had time to think about that shit. I'm on the way to the truck. I'm squaring up. Pop the truck on his ass. I'm not squaring up with a nigga that I know gonna beat my motherfucking ass up. It's not a question if he beat my ass. You go home the hero. It's all right, baby. It's my time. It's okay. Hey, right. You still go over here, nigga. Hey, you know what I'm saying? But you get your head, you, you just gotta do nothing. Nigga, hey, man. You, oh, no, I'm gonna you do fix something. your own taco, I big fella. I can't do something hey, right hey, then and that time unless I got Me that and my thing. bitch would be spooning right there. Cause right. he would have punched me and her together. We'd be sleep together. Hey, what Gina? <laughs> hey, what, hey, what, hey, what Gina do? What Gina do when uh, when uh, uh, uh hit me and uh, uh lumped up Martin? Yeah, yeah. She was she right, right there on the couch. Yeah. Come on, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> she, got, nigga. she was right there. You got lumped the fuck right. up. <laughs> Yo, just got your ass. Man. Yo, for sure, for sure. Hey, hey, Yo, if you check us out right now, man, we gonna get back on something. <laughs> if you checking me out right now, man, hit us in the comment box, dog. Let me know what you think, dog. Is are, are women getting overly sensitive or is this sexual harassment shit really like you know going it's down really now look they, they, they done hemmed up some like some senators or some shit right mm-hmm. uh, on some really sexual true. harassment yeah. shit yeah. now dog you gotta I gotta be honest with you dog these senators like 100 years old they've been they've been raping and sexually harassing bitches like they whole life like this is that's not nothing saying, new I start, now, saying, I that's, start telling that's what I'm saying and that's what I'm wondering now these now now. I understand that politicians kind of you know politicians and, 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 and millionaires and, and billionaires you know pretty much run the world and shit because they go hand in hand so maybe that's the intimidation the, the power intimidation I'm not sure but I 
I don't know what it is to be a woman. I have no idea, but I, I got to tell a motherfucker. I, like, what what's threatening your life to that point where where you got, like, some shit, if a nigga, like, for a chick, this is why I think some women are overly sensitive. It, it might be a nigga at your job that comments, that compliments you too much. All right, I wouldn't call that harassment. I think that's just a creepy ass nigga who just like the way you look. Right. You know what I'm saying? Now, now, now if, a, if a nigga saying, give me that throat and shit or you ain't getting this promotion, <laughs> that's sexual harassment. <laughs> I mean, for real, that's what I'm saying. Get, like, you know, throw that ass back or you ain't getting that motherfucking promotion. Yeah, that's yeah, sexual that's harassment. Sexual a right. nigga that keeps saying, like, mm, you looking good today, like, that's not harassment. That's just a creep ass nigga that don't know how to talk to women. Like, that's that just, happens. That's just a woman that's not should, knowing what the fuck should was. Lose his job. Nigga should lose his job. Just, no. No, he being a normal creep. Right. He's acknowledging your ass. I ain't even gonna say hello. He being a creepy nigga. Right, like you know, say he being no, creepy. Man, you know, after a while, you know. Mm. Every day, man, if he walks Every day when you talk to her. Every day and be like, damn, bitch, you ugly as hell. But now you even got some of the feminists <laughs> oh, damn, bitch, or some of the women book. that'll be like, you, hey, how, you, how you doing, beautiful? You know, you say something like that. Yeah. Do, do you talk to men like that, too? You call men beautiful? Well, right. Like, damn, motherfucker, shit. <laughs> What's up? <laughs> hey, how you doing? Uh, What's up, motherfucker? Right. Sis bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Stupid to say. Let me see. He said at all points it was disrespect. All right, yeah. Joe said at some point, at, at all points, it was disrespect. We're talking about what we were talking about just a minute ago. But yeah, when when a nigga come up and like disrespect you in front of your, your chick or whatever. But on, on this tip though, I think that it is it is some women who are overly sensitive for that reason. It is. So, it is. so you got some niggas who so. like like <laughs> first of all, before we got on 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 air and shit, Gigabytes was talking about how <laughs> I don't know if he's serious, but he said how he's he's frightened to death to be on the elevator with a white woman. Yeah, but I'm yeah, yeah. gonna tell you how funny that shit. Remember when, when that you that showed us that one that that blackish episode? Or no, that, I think that was my sister showed me that shit. It was a blackish episode when uh yeah. my man got on the elevator. It was a little white girl, and he was like, oh. Oh shit! He wouldn't get on the motherfucking elevator because he didn't want to be on that bitch with the little white girl by himself. Yeah, she was lost, and it, and it's fucked up because I think it's some niggas at work that feel that same way. They like they don't want to be alone with a white woman and shit, nope. and that's crazy though. Yeah, yeah. And, and see, that's why I say I think that yell something that you ain't did. Like, you like, gotta prove you. Like, oh, girl, you out here like Emmett Till and shit. Yeah, oh, Emmett Till. Yeah, you out here like Emmett Till, like this nigga whistled at me. Sam Cooke. Yeah, for sure. I never put too much thought to this shit. Let me see. She, uh, Candy Cane says, so yeah, sometimes calling women baby, sweetie and babe is disrespectful too. Really? What? But women do it all the time. In the workplace? Women do that shit. Yeah. Call you honey, honey and shit. Honey? Is that, should I be going to motherfucking uh, you know HR? Honey? Right, you ain't right. taste me. How you know? <laughs> that nigga say, how you know I'm honey? My yeah. name is Lee, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Well, <laughs> hey, hey, you address women like that? <laughs> right. And some women, that's really, that really is how they talk. They call everybody baby. They call everybody honey. Like, that's how they are. But, um, let me see. It's I got, I got messages coming in and everything. It's definitely levels to everything. Man. It's yeah. levels to everything you know what I'm saying? It's fucking creeps. But, yeah. like I said, yeah, some niggas is creeps. Some of them is creeps. And a lot of these yeah. dudes in power, man. Like all these fucking senators and all that shit, it just remind me of the Roman days. You know what I'm saying? Oh, here you go. You know I'm coming out with that shit. They coming out with the Terry Crew shit. That goes with the Terry Crew shit. Right. And you know what I'm saying? Sexual rather. Because they feel like shit, they empower, they can do anything they want to, dog. Power make you move in a different way, bro. Yeah. That's why when people get a lot of money, they act different, you know, they change oh, shit. and shit. He was probably yeah. high. He probably I ain't probably mad at a woman at her coke. job that fucks her way into a better position, man. God, <laughs> God, I ain't mad. At her, man. No, he didn't. As well, as well, <laughs> you gotta do the move up here. Most men would. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Let, my bo let my female yeah. boss want to fuck me and give me a promotion. I'm fucking the shit out of him. I'm like, baby, you gotta understand. I'm just saying. Yo, yeah, look, that's what that's what we talked about off camera too, though, is that a lot of dudes don't don't view that shit the same way. Just like, just to take it even a step further, you know, not to take it too far, but even a step further, it's some dudes who got molested as, as kids by older women. They didn't think of that as being molested. They thought of that shit like, I got, I got old, old and I hit that old bitch I hit that old bitch cut. Right. I that old bitch cut. Right. And I, I think it's just a, it's a frame of mind, though. I think it's so many women and that's why I say I, I, I do think, and I don't want to take nothing away from women who are getting sexually harassed, but dog, at some point, though, come on. Yeah, like, at, sexual it, harassment ain't what y'all always, what y'all fucking exactly. think it is. If it's a, I can, it's a, it's a thin it line, right. but it, there is a line between a nigga who just an uh, asshole and a nigga who really sexually harassing. Yeah. Like, to me, <laughs> sexual harassment means that 
I'm I'm giving you something in return for a sexual favor. That's what it seemed like to me. If I comment on the way you look, then I'm gonna probably need you not to wear them tight ass tights and Uggs and shit to work. Like if I can't comment on your, all right, I don't want to say that. Yeah, if I can't comment on your ass, don't hey, come but, to work. Put your ass out. Dude, it's work, my nigga. It's work, my nigga. It's like, like church. It don't matter. You going to church with a goddamn miniskirt on? <laughs> And the and the and the preacher preaching, he's the the st- 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 stutter. You know that's, what I'm saying? That's because they you gotta go to the deacon. bathroom. That's because they fucking deacon. Women, show that as a third. We looked at as a sexual as object. A hole if you wearing a hose uniform, yeah. that, that woman simple. still doesn't deserve to be looked at as a sexual object. Don't no. When she's Don't. showing her sexual okay. parts, shit. Why not? Look, look. She dressing sexy. She dressing definitely right. sexual. Okay, I got a question for you. Well, she shouldn't be shrewd. Look, if you run up to a woman and she got on a blue suit. Utility belt, badge, and gun. Chances are she's a what? Police. Okay, if she got on a motherfucking fire-retardant suit, the motherfucking the the helmet, for. the motherfucking fire-retardant coat on, and the boot, water uh, boots, she chances are she's a what? Fire. Okay, then if she got on a whole guard. suit on, how the fuck I'm supposed to not think she's a hoe? <laughs> I'm just saying. I know. work for Christ, you work for Ford, you don't wear a Chrysler motherfucking coat. Shit. You see what I'm saying? Wow. Plain and simple. Wow. Plain and simple. Hey, Kitty Kitty can't, can't, can't say that some of us can't hide our body parts no matter what we wear. Well, it's yeah. not about hiding it, but it's sometimes when you just got the so skirt on right shit. and crack in your ass. I mean, yeah. come on. You know, right. Some of that shit should be They do make shit a little yeah. better. Yeah. Yeah. If you if you wear motherfuckers see through stretch pants with a fucking thong on, and I say, damn, your ass look nice. What the fuck you looking at my ass for, bitch? Because I can see it. Yeah, you can I can see, see the whole complexion well, in there. I can ass. see the whole thing. <laughs> first, of all, I, first of all, I ain't gonna say that. <laughs> no, <laughs> but <laughs> at work, I'm gonna say, damn, that ass look nice. <laughs> no, oh, dog. Hey, you probably you compliment her every day, so that work. make you a creep. You gotta, you, gotta be, you gotta be an intelligent creep with your shit like that. Right, you gotta be like, you know. Wow, have you hey, been doing squats? If, if, yeah, it's like, there you go. See, that, that doing... nigga's a professional creep. Oh, <laughs> that nigga's a professional creep. That nigga's say, see, so you gotta say something that don't seem like you're creeping. That nigga's a professional creep. <laughs> something to finish down. Hey, bitch. Is that panel and hammer that way? No, you should. That nigga's a professional creep, dog. If something is being oh, shown, that it was funny. to be looked at. Perhaps it's not a pussy girl. If you're showing it, it's to be looked at. Yeah. Right. That's what you say? Yeah. That's what it is. I mean, what the fuck? If it's out, it's public motherfucking yeah. exposure. It's it's public. I can see it, though. And that's what the Muslims write. They chicks up. You can't see shit. Candy can't say we stereotype. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. No, She's, no, what, you can't hide your body part. I can hide a goddamn gun. You can hide your body parts. Plain and simple. <laughs> there's, clo- there's clothing in every size. Clown. You see what I'm saying? Just because you're a size 14... Don't mind you, mean you gotta wear a size 12. Where it is, get a fucking 16 then. Hey, Mel- Melissa said dress according. Like, what up, though? What up, Melissa? What up, though? True, true. Yo. true. <laughs> right, real right. Talk. Hey, but look, all right, look, I, I, I don't wanna take it to the extreme, man, but ahead, I, man. I, I, am, I am saying that it's still some women that's just, it's a little too much. It's some creepy niggas that don't understand. Sometimes they don't get the signal after they after they complimented you uh, seventeen days in a row. They didn't get that. They didn't get that look that you gave them. Like nigga, quit saying that shit to them. They didn't get it. Like they didn't understand. But that don't mean that they sexually harassed you though. You know what I'm saying? That just means that they they don't know how to talk to women. And, and there's a lot of awkward ass niggas out here that's like that. You might you see you see some comments you want to read. Some dudes. Just being, some dudes. Just she, she said she said not the damn saying not a gun and shit. No, it's like it, anyway. It might not be a gun, but the show is. It might not be a gun. You got a gun. You got them titties. And that ass. And that ass. Well talk. Co- cover that shit up. Cover that shit up. Cover that shit up. It's a lot of thick ass Muslims around this bitch. You ain't gonna see you don't see shit. Wait a minute. So you expect the niggas to look like Muslims? No, but I'm saying I expect these niggas to look like the Muslims, but they rap them up because they don't want you to get no thought of the shit. That bitch got some pretty ass eyes, nigga. Some beautiful eyes. Uh, yeah. <laughs> beautiful you would never know. You know what I'm saying? Like, room. I ain't saying nothing. Not you know. What I'm saying y'all women, so y'all want to show y'all sexuality and all that old shit. But my thing is though, if you're not looking for those fucking compliments, yeah. wear a size bigger. Simple as that. <laughs> a size yeah, like bigger. Girl, see a dress right. approach. Yeah. You want to feel sexy? Feel sexy at, at home. home. Yeah. Yeah. You don't want to be sexualized. Don't dress sexual. 
You know what I'm saying? Like I you mean, just, still. You just went on your little rant about the preaching shit. It's real talk. If you yeah. dress like that, bro, that's what you're going to get. You ain't yeah. expecting that some way, somehow. Right, and, and, what, I'm, and what I'm saying is, cause, like, again, I don't want to get this shit misconstrued and shit. I'm not saying that it's all right for a nigga to, to say like no. my man was saying on... Uh, who was that? Uh, J. Will, comic J. Will. He was like, Daddy got a fat ass. Like, of course. You know you can't say that. You can't say that. You can't say that. Now, not? I mean, not to her. <laughs> like, when you, when you and the homie in the break room, y'all can be like, cuz. Oh, no, <laughs> that's, 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 that's not at work etiquette at, home, at, at all. Well, no, that's not work etiquette. You can say it's at work you etiquette said, at you all. You can say your co is a stripper. You know what I'm saying? Then you got a fat ass, but yeah. you know. Well, then you might as well catch your, catch your ass second I mean, job. I mean, right, right, the cover then, joint. then this bitch's name is Sherbert. Too, you know what I'm saying? Or Sherbert. Sherbert. You know. This nigga said Sherbert. What club you go to? You've been out. Right. Yeah. 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 That bitch was 62 or something. Lord, Sherbert. Come into the stage. Sherbert. 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 Up for your viewing pleasure. Sherbert. There's a stripper right now watching his name, Sherman. Yeah. 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 Uh, Candy K said Muslims get harassed too. They do. Uh, yeah. Man, she got some pretty ass eyes. Cause what the fuck can you harass? I mean, you can't see no face. You think you can say You might You can say some shit like, let me like, see what's up under that sheet. Your toenails, they match. Hey, hey, let me get up under that Martha Stewart. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> sexy ass eyebrows, man. <laughs> sexy ass eyebrows. Wow. Hey. That unibrow. <laughs> mm. Hey, it's all about that bush. The way it arches. <laughs> your, your eyebrows. So Bushy. Like, <laughs> so bushy. Damn. Yo, yeah, we got a few minutes left. Oh, if you check us out right now on uh, Facebook Live or on eblockradio.com, make sure you hit us in the comment box. We want to know, are women getting overly sensitive or is sexual harassment really rising? All I right? say it never went nowhere. Yeah, it's you say it's just getting woman. vocalized. Yeah, it's it's same more people was just telling. Just like yeah. cops whooping our ass. That shit was yeah. happening a long time ago. But we was telling. We was telling, though. Yeah. Like, nobody just... Damn, is this the same? Is that yeah. the same thing? Damn, now that I said it out loud, I guess that's the yeah. same thing. Yeah. Damn. Sorry, ladies. I didn't even realize until I said yeah. it out loud. Yeah. That was a teachable moment right yeah, there. Because when you just said it, I said this shit out loud. Like, yeah. Yeah, like yeah, right. <laughs> yeah. Hey, nigga, I'm sorry. Shit. <laughs> but y'all going to be at, at work for the bold as hell. Because niggas ain't even going to speak to your ass. They, gonna, like, they ain't going to say good morning. Like, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, 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 nah, yeah. I did. Good morning. That's right. Keep it, keep it moving. Shit, you know, at halfway don't even want to smile. Shit, they might think you was trying to flirt with like, no, nah, I was just uh, just saying good morning and smiling. Right, that's it. I don't know. That's a tough thing, though. But, you know, you also, like, I, I want I want women, and obviously, I, I guess dudes, too, and shit. I guess they got to be comfortable, too, thanks to Terry Crews. But, uh, yeah. as far as, mm -hmm. but women, I want y'all to, I want y'all to be comfortable, but at the same time, I don't want to, I don't want to feel like gigabytes. I don't want to feel like I can't get in the elevator with a white woman alone and shit and, and, and a fear of something happening. I don't want to yeah, feel like that either. Like you know either, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. So, like, it's a, I don't know, dog. You, but you thing. don't want to feel that way, but you have no other choice but to feel yeah. that way. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Like, y'all ain't giving us no choices. You know what I'm saying? Like, these yeah. days, like Emmett Till and, you know what I'm saying? What's my other man's name? I'm Sam, 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 Sam Cooke. Cook. You know what I'm saying? Just like them situations. You're afraid of that shit, bro. <laughs> Like when the police come by you, bro, I don't give a fuck how brave nigga you are. You gonna yeah. feel you legit and everything. You gonna feel something like everybody oh, shit. say, oh yeah. shit. Yeah, yeah. Right. yeah. exactly. Yeah. Everybody. Fuck. Yeah, the so fuck. Right. Oh, that's a fuck. It that ain't feeling. just about a ticket. Hell no. And we can take now, the I remember ticket. back in the day, that's what it was though. Like, fuck, I don't wanna get a ticket. Or damn, I ain't got my license. Yeah, I ain't never think that back, back in the day, shot. man, I ain't never think that the police was gonna shoot me. Even when they used to jump out on us and shit. Yeah. I yeah. thought they was gonna I knew they were gonna stretch us. Yeah. We might get our head slammed against the car. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 You know what I'm saying? Never thought about dying. Never thought about that they would kill us. Yeah. You know what That's what I'm saying. saying. It's, it's more, these but motherfuckers... moving funny or breathing. Like, what yeah. the fuck yeah. is yeah. from? I don't move. When, I did, don't when, when did these motherfuckers... When did, when did fear become the motto? Yeah. Yeah. That's what it is. And look, not, like I said, not to stay off topic too long, but I just seen... I think it's either tonight or, or one of these nights. They got a news special, basically, talking about the proper procedure. 
for a nigga to get pulled over, dog. Like, well, we supposed why the fuck do? Yeah, what we supposed to do? Ain't that a bitch? Yeah. I gotta have a proper procedure on getting pulled over. How? Have you ever no, it's how, how to hey, how to you, comply. But you know, have you ever watched that Chris Rock? How not to get your ass pulled yeah, by the police? Yeah, yeah. If you follow those simple rules, <laughs> chances are you won't get your ass whooped by the police. Man, you see but you know what? I take that though. I take an ass whooping before I want to get killed, yeah, nigga. Yeah, I take yeah, an yeah. ass whooping. Well, not the Ryan the King ass whooping, but the, no, the regular ass, ass whooping. That was an ass. That was ass whooping. For that payday, I'll take it. Nine million. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take an ass whooping for nine yeah, million. Yeah, that nigga dead now, though, so all of them. Maybe I wouldn't have took it. He's already over. After the lawyer fees and everything. Damn, 49 man. and 1 He was on dope yeah. loan He was taking fronts and loans You know yeah. what I'm saying You know he yeah. fucked a lot of that money up for him you know, <laughs> And then, and then started advances. a studio nigga And then lost it all Damn He's, He started a little record studio For who? The dope <laughs> man <laughs> the dope Did he OD to that motherfucker Yo my man Joe said It is a Muslim girl Just got harassed a few days ago By her teacher Ripping her head garment off And uh What'd she say? Oh, oh she said Cause uh Cause she was hiding her pretty hair Like shit I, You know what I ain't yeah, fuck no, with them wild. Yeah, I ain't yeah. fuck with them. Like, especially a kid at school. Like, you can't do that can't shit. Do that shit. Yeah, you can't do that don't shit. Don't do that shit to nobody. Nobody. <laughs> right, but it's especially like, a kid you know at school. Yeah, man. Nobody, a, an adult should. can at least fight you off. A kid at school, you the teacher. Even, yeah. That's a, that you shit know. That yeah. should have worn across your mind, bro. Right. right. You know what I'm saying? That should have even worn across that my mind, bro. <laughs> hey, y'all, I can't. Candy can't say that. She said, that's bullshit. She said, ass. A poke out the sheet <laughs> if she got ass or boobs. <laughs> I was yeah. thinking the same shit. Yeah. I ain't gonna hold you. I was thinking the same shit. I mean, real it creep. will. It will. But y'all, you got to be like, like looking damn, real hard. But, but see, you be like, you damn, be real look like she got yeah, ass. Damn, your silhouette is banging. Yeah. <laughs> you, <laughs> look like, right. you look like she got ass. Right. She got a dunk. I mean, you got to be but real. You got to imagine. But if you gonna have some see through shit. Or some goddamn it's spandex. It's all out there fucking. I, I ain't got to imagine a motherfucking thing. I start pulling out wands. You stupid. Oh, let low down. We fucking around. It's all after 8 o'clock. <laughs> we fucking around. We started. Yeah, yeah, yeah we, we started late and shit. But on that note, dog, we going to go around the, the room one last time. Dog, we got any comments that we going to read out there, though? I think I think we got to everybody. So we're going to go around one last time. We want to know real quick, man. Sexual harassment. Is that shit on the rise? Or is women just over? You know I don't say over, overdoing it. Over I don't think it, I don't think it's on the rise because if you think about it, man, there the same level has been there always. It got generalized and publicized once that Clarence Thomas Anita Hill shit. Man, that's what actually cube hair on the coke on the coke can. Yeah, shit. that's what actually Pepsi turned it into a fucking law. Yeah, and the women said, you know what? That happened to me. That shit happened to me. <laughs> right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And, Oh, shit, I can get some money. Right. And see, that's the that's where it all leads to. They can get some money because if the woman is found that she was harassed, mm -hmm. now she can sue the company sure. and she has valid case to get money. Mm -hmm. yeah. You see what I'm saying? So I believe it's a hustle. A lot of it now. <laughs> once it becomes, oh, so once something becomes law, it becomes a hustle. Child support, goddamn, <laughs> all that. What's it going on? The Food Network. Fuck the Food Network. <laughs> Fuck the Food Network. <laughs> yeah, just uh, throw that in there real quick. Fuck food. <laughs> Call that Lee, man. What you say? I say that shit been, you know, it's about the same. Low yeah. key, low key, it might not be as bad as it used to be when you right. really think yeah, about it. Yeah. Yeah. Because you when you be really go all the way, yeah, because when it you wasn't think no about law, so day, was like, Fuck. You know, that's when a motherfucker literally just being public in the mall and <laughs> smack his chick for being out of line and yeah. continue shopping. Nobody yeah. said shit. Yeah. You know, but you know. Yeah, that's true. Two G's, wanna, man. You, you hey, man, uh, dudes is purged, man. That's <laughs> right, man. He just gonna keep saying that shit. Yeah, man. Dudes is purged, man. A lot, of, a lot of dudes like not raised from personal experience. You're a professional. I mean, you know creep. what I'm saying? I'm, you know, <laughs> I mean, you know what I'm saying? Creep. But you know, I, I was always respectful. You know what I'm saying? Well, you know, when I came across creepy. <laughs> More money, dog. No, I, I, I ain't fucking with you, dude. More money, what you saying? You know what I'm saying? It's hey, a difference. Hey, I say this shit ain't been nowhere. Put that on the shirt. It always respectful been around. Creepy. <laughs> right. Keep that on end, though. We're gonna edit that here. Yeah. We don't nobody steal our shit. Hey. I don't think it left anywhere. Yeah. I think it's just more exposed. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Cause niggas like he just said, he just gave you an example how this shit happened a long time ago. You oh, know yeah. what I'm saying? Cause there wasn't no law, so they yeah. was really yeah. 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 So it got a little better, you know what I'm saying? They like like I say, they burn their bras, they got you all got the same rights as us. Right. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. 
we got a lot of shit happening on us on a daily day basis. Right. Stop now. whining, bitches. No, I'm just joking. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Turn up. Right, we yeah, just lost joking. all kinds of spots. Turn up. I'm joking. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. But I'm just saying, though, I mean, it, it, it's happening, bro. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, we bigger than the woman, so you can do whatever you want with it if you want to. If you want to. You know what I'm saying? And that's the fear they got. You know yeah. what I'm talking about? I feel that, man. And to a certain degree, like I said, I, I do agree that obviously it's been going on and probably it's more incentive now to come out and talk about mm -hmm. it. But at the same time, I got to say that some of some of these women are overly sensitive. Some of this shit is not sexual harassment. It's just awkward niggas that don't know how to talk to women. Like, there is a fine line. Just like it's women like that. Yeah. It's, some, it's some awkward ass women who think that being overly aggressive is cool. Sometimes that shit ain't cute. No, Sometimes an overly aggressive woman is a little bit high. Like, yeah, come yeah, on, bitch. Slow down. All right, you know what I'm saying? So, down, yeah, calm down. So sometimes that's a problem. And it's just some socially awkward people out here Kay. don't automatically <laughs> equal sexual harassment. So, yes, I think that some women are overly sensitive. And we probably lost all of our sponsorship for women. But that's okay, though. Y'all was probably sensitive no, we today. we still love y'all. We still love y'all. Yeah. We, we, we just we know y'all be lying about some hey, shit. Hey, go to our Patreon and shit. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, cry while you doing it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Willie will, 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 will send you some pink hearts and shit. You know, pink ribbons. Duh, and breast cancer <laughs> awareness. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck? On that note, dog. Get the fuck out of here. On that note, obviously it's time to go, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right, he just went all downhill. Thanks, everybody, for checking us out on eblockradio.com. Everybody on Facebook Live, dog. Make sure. Before we go, I got one question. What's that? Nigga, if, if Jeffrey Dahmer was still alive, you think he'd have been an Uber driver today? <laughs> <laughs> what? What the fuck did that come from? Yo. Oh, uh, 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 that's what the evil at. We really, we or really out here. <laughs> oh, this thing is going way <laughs> far. Yo, we up out here, dog. You are. This thing is I got my man Gigabytes in the building. I'm out of here, nigga. I got my man Kodak Lee. Peace out. You know what I'm saying? I got my man 2Gs. Sure, for sure. And of course, we got Monk Money holding it down. You know what it is. <laughs> and I'm your boy, man, the hood. I was starting Q Lewis. Hold it down from six miles to the mile high, man. We about this joint, man. Peace. Deuces. <laughs> that nigga said an Uber driver. This <laughs> nigga retarded.